cutest freaking color for the summertime. What will they think? So we just did a podcast on that. Oh, I'm having a ball with this. <laughs> I'm gonna have to move out for like a week or two, which I'm like, ugh. I got us matching friendship bracelets. So this has a J. this lighting makes me look funky today's Wednesday I am about to go to a bar class oh my phone is blowing up bar class at 9 15 it is currently 8 30 a.m. this past weekend was July 4th weekend I'm lucky for sure but it was just like a very like weekend so I've been struggling this week with just energy levels I had to go right back to work yesterday insert clip here but I shot my happy and healthy merch yesterday so I did that and that was really fun. Today I'm filming a podcast with a guest called Grace Valentine. This week has been crazy already it feels like. And then tomorrow at 6 a.m. I'm leaving to LA. So lots of stuff, lots of things going on. Um, so I'm gonna get ready and I just do my skincare routine, drink my coffee, I need to get ready for my bar class. And we'll do more updates. So anyway, cheers y'all. I'm gonna do my skincare. My robe is in the way. Um, I'm gonna put in some eye drops so I've posted about this before, but you guys can see. Maybe you can't see. <laughs> My eyes are pretty red right now. Um, and so these help your, I'm running out, but these help your eyes just go. Putting in eye drops looks really weird. Let it sit for like one second and they will just pop. And that, that, these are like great for like a photo shoot or anything. They really help a lot. And then your eyes will start to slowly adjust. Anyway, so this past weekend was 4th of July and it was really freaking fun. I just had the world's busiest weekend, but I'm not complaining. I'm very thankful I had plans. Um, it was just very hard to wake up for work yesterday. Yesterday I shot merch and that was a really early shoot to get good lighting. So that was a lot, but also can y'all see my eyes are now, they're brighter. But yeah, the weekend was, it was a blast. And I had my mom's birthday last night, so that was fun too. Um, also, I just wanted to thank you guys so much for your comments in the last vlog of just everyone being so sweet and just being, and even like sending me personalized messages on Instagram. I mean, so sweet. Thank you guys so much for just the support and the feedback and everything. You guys rock. Anyway, I've been just working a ton lately. Like I'm working on another new project, which part of me is like, do I really need to do this right now? I was kind of like, I was kind of like praying about it yesterday being like, Lord, do I really need to do this? It's something that's like been on my bucket list for a very long time. And obviously like if it happens, I'm going to announce it, but it's that it's like this thing where it's going to take a lot of planning a lot of people involved and I'm like am I ready for that right now I'm already like talking about how I'm overwhelmed and stressed but I don't know I'm thinking about that one right now <laughs> um also I'm going to LA tomorrow I'm going to shoot my merch out there with my podcast coordinator I'm really excited about that and I'm bringing on three different guests at my studio so my agency has a studio out there that I can film in which is really fun so I'll be out there filming that and then my best friend Penny's birthday is on Saturday, which if y'all have been around, you know who Penny is. She's an og -er. She's my best friend that I've known for a really long time. She's from South Africa. I mean, no, she's not. She's from Zimbabwe. And that'll be fun. And I am just going to go out there and work on other stuff. It's going to be really good. So that's something I'll be doing tonight is packing for that.
right, hello everyone. I am back home. The workout was good. It wasn't my favorite today, personally, but it was still good. I'm glad I got active. Um, I had some quick breakfast because I actually didn't eat this morning, so I had a bagel and some eggs, and I didn't vlog it because I had some contractors here. So, if you guys saw in my last video, I was talking about, you know, how I was having some issues. Well, here they are. My floor is having issues here and there. And um, that's been pretty frustrating. Another fun thing, though, is that I finally got my credenza in. I'm obsessed with it. This area is finally complete, thank God. Um, but yeah, we're gonna have to redo floors in the entire house. If you guys can see, we have like tape because there's leaking pipes, which the leaking pipes explains why this keeps happening. So I'm gonna have to move out for like a week or two, which I'm like, ugh. So I'm gonna have to move out and then um, redo the whole floors, which I'm kind of excited because. These floors, like, they're nice, whatever, but they're not my favorite flooring. So now I can finally get the floors I really want, and I'm excited for that. So that'll be quite the process here at the end of the month. Yay. Anyway, okay, I got to film a podcast with a guest. I got to get ready to do my makeup, prepare all the things. So let's go get ready for the day. I have done my makeup. Uh, this is kind of just like a, oh, my blush is a little off. Oh my gosh, the camera picks up everything. In person, it didn't look like that. Anyway, so I'm filming a podcast in about 50 minutes. I'm gonna do my laundry, I gotta prep for it. I gotta change, because I'm still wearing like comfy clothes. Uh, but yeah, I like my makeup today. And then yeah, there's just a lot to do. And then Maddie just invited me to David Buster's tonight, which I'm like, is that the most responsible for thing for me to be doing tonight? I'm not sure, but if I can get everything done on my to-do list, I'm gonna do it. So, yep, I'm gonna go do my laundry and then prep for this podcast, but I have Grace Valentine coming. She just wrote a book. She's awesome, I've known her for a while, so I'm excited to see her and interview her. Stay tuned. Hi, Maddie. Can you look at my hair and see what you think? Huh? Can you look at my hair and see what you think? <laughs> Why did I, I... I don't think that's what I was expecting. <laughs> Wait, is someone at the front door? Hey, Josie. Hey, Josie. Hi. Wait, Josie, can I get your thoughts on my new haircut? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> you don't oh, like it? It's so good. <laughs> you don't like it. <laughs> I'm so offended. <laughs> oh, I'm having a ball with this. <laughs> okay, I pranked Maddie and that was super fun. And now I want to show you guys um, some pieces from Fabletics in July. Now, I've worked with Fabletics for a very long time because they really do have some of the best pieces. I, I wear them almost every single time I work out and I love their stuff. And part of the reason why I like them so much is because they do combine fitness and fashion which helps you feel confident in whatever you're doing. So no matter what size you are, what activity you're doing, they have clothing for that. So my link will be down below if you guys want to check out any of these pieces. I'm going to show you guys a couple pieces that are super cute from this month. And don't forget, when you join as a VIP member, you get a massive discount. You get any two bottoms for $24 as well as 80% off everything else. It's a great deal. I'm going to show you guys some of the pieces. Okay, so first is this outfit right here. Absolutely love these shorts. They have a little 
pocket here in the back as well as a built-in underwear and then it's perfect for summer because it's super super hot here in texas so these are nice and breathable and then i have this cute tank which i have a short torso so i probably will tie it like that or something and then it has this cute little fabletics detail in the back that says fabletics and this is also very very lightweight and breathable so this is the first one okay so here is the next set it has this adorable confetti pattern you can roll this up or roll it down and like adjust how tight you want it i always roll everything down because then my short torso and everything is squat proof so ladies <laughs> you can squat in these and look how cute the back is there's also a pocket back here if you want to stick your phone in absolutely love this one and it does make the girls look pretty good but i'm not one that like wants to reveal everything but um very very cute absolutely love this one as well okay so here is the next one this is part of their yitty collection look how cute this is i absolutely love that these like match or whatever i don't know i love this color and i love that these kind of i don't i just like the font is so fun on this and this is their i'm just gonna read it it's their major label cross front bralette this is what the back of it looks like it has this really cool mesh detail so it's nice and breathable this is such a fun little set as well okay here is the next outfit this is part of their yitty collection as you guys can see so it has it here and here um, the name of this is the major label cross front bralette and the major label high-waisted leggings now this material is very very soft it's so cute and look at the back the back has this really nice mesh detail so it's nice and breathable i think this is just like a really cute outfit you can really like play around with this outfit like you could dress this up and make it kind of like a streetwear kind of vibe or you can work out in it but this one's really cute so this is the live-in high neck dress this is just in black they have multiple colors it's so cute i mean i could literally just go to the beach in this or go to dinner in this how fun you really can dress this up and dress this out as well. And this is very comfy. This is so pretty and just very flattering. I love this one. Okay, the last one is the on-the-go built-in bra dress. This is a cute little tennis dress. Also has a pocket back here. If you're new here, I love tennis dresses. I have been a big fan of them, love them. Just heads up though, you do need to wear spandex underneath this. So if you're gonna be playing sports, I recommend adding some spandex, but it's very comfy and I definitely love the support of the bra in here. Very flattering, I love the neckline. And they have also different colors in this as well. Very, very cute. I have this in like purple and I also have have it in green and it's absolutely adorable so definitely love this one for the summertime as well because it's so hot and i want to be able to just throw something on and get out the door which is exactly what this dress is on the go dress and like i said i have this dress in this other color misty lilac the cutest freaking color for the summertime so you have different options here for color so check it out okay so those are some of the july pieces from fabletics as you guys can see they are so cute this color is adorable so if you guys want to get any of these the link is always down below for fabletics again if you join as a vip member you guys can get any two bottoms for 24 dollars plus 80 percent off everything else and just so you guys know they also drop new styles every single thursday and their Fabletics exclusive Instagram outfit is going to be dropping July 14th. So it might already be up by the time you guys are watching this. Hope you guys will check them out. And thank you so much to Fabletics for sponsoring this portion of the video. They have such cute pieces. You guys can check it out down below. And now I'm going to start packing for my trip tomorrow. Guys, look who's here. Hi, it's Miss Grace Valentine. Why do I keep calling you Miss? I know. Like, like, like you're like official. 30. I'm know, like, okay. wait. Okay. It's the long hair. It's the 26. That no, I just she just got extensions and they look beautiful. I, I love it, them. It looks better when you curl it, but. Super fun. No, it looks good. Makes me feel flirty in 26. <laughs> I just had her in um, my podcast. We reviewed her book, this one right here. What will they think? So we just did a podcast on that. I'm not sure when it'll be up, but soon. But yeah, check out her book. Yay. Thanks for coming to it. Yeah, it's so fun. Here. Your house is beautiful. Oh, it's it, great. It needs some work. I've been, Janine. <laughs> I recommend it. <laughs> I've been telling people, I'm like, my house needs some work. Every time someone comes to the door, they trip on the floors. And I'm like, watch your step, watch your step. Yeah. So, homeowner life. You I know. know. It's not yeah. all she gets it too. So, I get yeah. it. My little house. Okay, bye, y'all. Okay, so I filmed with Grace and put my tennis dress back on because it's comfortable and I just get a couple things done on my computer now I need to send my editor all the footage from today and then I need to go run some errands y'all I'm like really tired it's four o'clock I'm really tired but I have more things to do I need to go grab a gift I still need to pack I got invited to something tonight which I really doubt I'm gonna be able to go to but um 
and I have a 6 a.m. flight and so I just need to get a lot of stuff done before that happens so I'm gonna work here for a little bit and then I think go run to the mall to go grab my friend a gift just got to Target it is so hot outside like unbearably hot okay so I'm at Target and I'm in the party section the birthday theme this weekend is Hawaiian and I see nothing here so I might need to go to Party City but I have nothing for the party like I don't have a Hawaiian shirt so not sure what to do there. <laughs> All right, I am at Party City and I found it. Perfect. Okay, now I'm at North Park Mall. They're having the Nordstrom anniversary sale. I don't need to buy anything. My phone just stopped recording randomly. Um, I don't need to buy anything, but I did get Sarah and I, let me show y'all. I got us matching friendship bracelets. So this has a J and this has an S for Sarah. So I got that and I'm heading up to anthropology. Y'all, I'm back home and I'm pretty discouraged. I went to go find her a gift for hours and like, yeah, I found stuff for her at like Target, but nothing that really like stuck out to me. Like I got the matching bracelets. I bought her a book for her first day of work that she's starting in a new company. And so like I did what I could, but there wasn't like a gift that I was just like, Yes, like this is it. So I'm gonna try to like prime, like Amazon prime something to her maybe, but I got like some gifts, but I'm not like super ecstatic about them. And like, I love giving people good gifts. So we'll see. But anyway, I'm about to eat dinner. It is now 7 p.m. I am honestly so tired. Like I decided not to go hang out with Maddie and some friends tonight because I need to pack. I have a 6 a.m. flight. So I'm just gonna be eating leftovers from Maggiano. And fun fact, we keep our microwave up here. It's nice and hidden. Actually, I don't even know if you can microwave this. I'm not even gonna eat all this. But anyway, basically, I just feel like the mall was not a complete success and I was just so over it. Like, I think because I'm just so tired, I like ended up caving and getting this energy drink and what did it do? Nothing. It didn't even give me energy. It just gave me a faster heart rate and I didn't need that. So, um... You know what? We learn our lessons and we're all good. Um, okay, I'm gonna eat this and then start packing. Okay, before I end today's vlog, I have to pack for LA. So I need to clear off my bed with the other laundry that I did and I'm gonna pack and hopefully be in bed because I have to literally wake up at probably 3.50 a.m. <laughs> Yay, let's pack. Oh my gosh, you guys, it is now 10.42 and I have just finished packing. I'm so tired. I, I just have to pack up my toiletries. I have to wake up at 3.50 in the morning. I'm exhausted. Today was the longest day, at least that's how it felt. Thank you again to Fabletics for sponsoring a portion of this video. Again, the link is down below. I'm off to LA. It's going to be a good weekend and I appreciate you guys checking out my vlog and yeah, you guys can find all my links down below, my Instagram, TikTok, podcast, everything. You guys are the best. Um, I'm exhausted. I also took melatonin and I am wiped. Thanks for watching. I'll see y'all soon. Peace out. I can't even say it. Peace out. Girl Scout. Bye guys.